this video is not one of those videos or like in the, in the next couple of weeks to come I'm going to be posting some videos about stuff that's going on in my home country which is Nigeria and I think it's really painful to see, it's, it's disheartening to see about things like this but it's a good thing the world is finally catching on like you know my mom has been always calls me complaints and tells me shit like that every day like for like the past six seven eight months nine months but even since last year like he's been getting worse and worse under the ruling of the current person and you know what i'm saying and i don't even get it like it's just sad to see like this video that you guys are about to watch is basically a video where angry protesters found a warehouse filled with food that was supposed to be for like the community or like the, the season it's just just like how in america they give out 1200 like covid COVID, COVID relief or whatever they call that shit. Like, you know, like how every American citizen got that. Nigeria was supposed to have that. I think it was supposed to be food given out to people in the streets, like without hunger and like, they have jobs to go to and stuff. And the government hid that. The relief funds that were supposed to be used all hid it. Nobody knows where it, where it is. So if you guys have been seen on most of my recent videos, I've updated them and I've started putting the hashtag cancers. And I'm doing this intro right here to tell you guys to please go on your social media, go on the internet. Even if you can't be in Nigeria, helping the protest right now the least you can do is just go on your social media pictures you post instagram or even just search the tag and saw it so you can see more about what i'm talking about it's, it's really crazy out there and me being a nigerian i feel obligated to actually say something having a platform like i do now and which is very 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 big thanks to every one of you like i couldn't have done it by myself you know what i'm saying so yeah like i feel like it's only right for me to tell you guys to please support in any way you can there's people suffering out there even my mom that's not even like in the streets calls me to complain like you, like that, that's how bad it is like a woman that basically has all she needs like is complaining like still very worried about how the state of the country is like it's crazy so please 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 i won't say enjoy the video but just sympathize with us and support in any way you can. I, I really don't know much about like the links to donate money if there's a, there's a link for that but if it is I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the description when I edit this video so yeah please go ahead and check the uh, description if there's any links or anywhere you can support in any way I'm gonna go ahead and put it down there and you guys please support them and please Nigerians stay calm don't worry violence is not always the answer but sometimes it is like I feel like in times like this right now a little bit of violence is I feel like somebody needs to go in that fucking uh, in Abuja. Where does he stay? I forgot what it's called there. I don't care about that shit that much. That's how much I hate it. But like, where the president stay? If someone is going there and slap the shit out of his dumbass, you know what I'm saying? Because he, like, how, how has nobody said anything about what's going on? It's, it's crazy, man. Even the Lagos, Samuel, like the massacre that happened at the Togi. But that's that's a topic for another day. I'll, I'll try to find more videos to post uh, post to y'all. I'm gonna create a, a section of my channel. I know my channel is mostly all reactions, but I feel like look, that's the least. It's just like the least I can do to like help spread the word, like to show like shit is going down in Nigeria. And nobody's giving a fuck like they should. Like right now, I'm saying if it was America, that shit was going on. Black Lives Matter everywhere. Like all lives matter. You know what I'm saying? Even allies in Africa matter. You know what I'm saying? But, Enjoy the video and I'll see you in the next video. Subscribe if you want to. I do mostly reactions. You guys have a reaction from me. Go ahead and let me let me know. I do. I might start doing vlogs too. So but yeah, man, that's still for another day. Let's go ahead and check it out. Right? Our food plenty, 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 plenty. Food plenty. Our food plenty for dear. A warehouse of 600 feet by 600 feet. Full of COVID-19 products. Was discovered today. Look at people struggling to pass. This, pro this incident has been going on since 7 a.m. As I speak with you, sources say the warehouse has not gone off. Palliative that we're supposed to be giving to people during the COVID-19 period was hidden away. 
Nigerians were dying in a warehouse, of and Nigerians were dying, were dying of hunger and starvation. Look at this man struggling to survive. Yes. Can you imagine? Look at him. Something. For all of us. Something that is supposed to be brought to his where they to his home. This thing for the past two hours. Look at it. Can you imagine? Nigeria has more than enough. The, has more than enough. the Navy has collected their own. The armies have put their truck, collected their own. Immigration, custom, last man. And the warehouse has not gone half. The warehouse has not gone half. The warehouse has not gone half. Palating for the poor. Stored away. This is October 20, 21st, 2020. Palliatives that were supposed to be shared in May were stored away. Some of the products are even expired. Look at how people are struggling. They are not expired though. 2021. You see? You see? You see? You see? You see? See, see people are struggling. You see? You see? Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Not for sale. Not for sale. They stored it. Look at it. Not for sale. They stored it. Wait. Wait. Let me see the back. Now see. Look at it. COVID-19. Not for sale. The poor are suffering. And they stored it in a warehouse. Look at people passing through canal Hunger, just to Hunger. survive. Hunger in the land. A surcharge of uh, 30 tomato, 120 naira. Look at people struggling to survive. We are suffering. Look at people. Bag of rice, 40,000 naira. Look at people. Come to our aid, though. Echoes, come to our aid, though. These people are brutal. They are criminals. I'm telling you. Just imagine COVID 19 palliatives. Just look at yeah. wow. everybody felt feel that place like one zone. Everybody just fight it. <laughs> They want okay. to use it for campaign and rally. All right. You can see. Okay. If the Nigeria government is not wicked, during COVID 19, we are very hungry. Guys, look at the people who are dying. People are dying. Youth are hungry. Unemployment everywhere. Guys, it's a relief package. Yes. COVID 19. Not wicked. 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 Not wicked.